new information about a vacation tragedy in Florida. Three family members from Massachusetts killed in this terrible crash. The victims, a five-year-old girl, her mother, and grandmother, were all in the back seat of a van that got hit by another driver. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Lisa Hughes. And I'm David Wade. Tonight, a new police report shows that all of the children and the three adults in the van were wearing seatbelts when this crash happened. One adult was not. Police say the family was traveling on Highway 429, which is near Orlando, when traffic suddenly came to a stop and a truck behind them didn't hit the brakes in time. WBZ's Bill Shields is live in Whitman tonight with this story. Bill? David and Lisa, you know, I don't have to tell you, this is about as sad as it gets. I mean, here you have three generations of one family all down at Disney World to have a great time, school vacation week, and now this they're a beautiful family our hearts are broken she knew all four smith kids they all went to preschool here 41 year old julie smith has died along with her five-year-old daughter scarlett and julie's mother josephine fay with jack now on life support three other family members survived along with julie's husband shane i just can't even imagine it's it's unimaginable it should have been the happiest of vacations, three generations of one family at Disney World. But then their van was rear-ended. We got social services over there last night. The nurses have been phenomenal, and they've been giving this family support in this tragedy. At the grandparents' home in South Weymouth, flowers on the front steps. And at Whitman, ripples of sadness sweeping through the town. As we are preparing for families and our community members, we have counseling staff available um, in our schools, the schools that were affected. The schools are prepping counselors to deal with one and maybe two deaths of children. It's, it's awful. It really is. Um, and I think we'll go through that as we go day by day, uh, hour by hour, day by day as a district. An 11-year-old Jack is, as I said earlier, on life support in Florida right now. And uh, I think this town is, everyone is just reeling from this. And uh, I think some people we talked to today were kind of dreading the end of school vacation week to see what happens in schools with the kids and everything. Just no words, really. Reporting live from Whitman, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Back to you guys. You are right.